Today marked the end of an era for West Michigan's largest school district as students and staff said a final farewell to Creston High School. We first told you last year about Grand Rapids Public Schools' major transformation plan that would close 10 schools and modify more. 24-Hour News 8's Danny Carlson has been covering the plan since that big announcement, and she's live right now with what happened on the last day for Creston. Danny. Yes, yeah, Sue and Brian, as you guys can imagine, it was a mix of emotions here in the last day at Creston. Now, since the superintendent announced last year that she planned to close this high school as a part of a bigger plan that would save the district millions of dollars, people here have gone through a wide variety of emotions, and today people seem sad but resigned as they said goodbye and good luck for good. Marking that last answer, filling in that last bubble. It was a day of final exams at Crescent High School today. The final part of them taking on a whole new meaning this year. Thank you guys. Because today, 89 years, nine months, and four days after it became Creston, Creston is no more. Creston has been here for so long, and I want to be a part of that history, but it's ending short. The more than 600 students, a number that fills less than half the historic building, will all have to make that choice. Go to one of the other two GRPS comprehensive high schools, apply to City High, the Teston school which will occupy Creston next year, or leave GRPS altogether. Normally I would be really happy, but then I think that this is the last year Creston's going to be open and I don't come back next year. As a junior, I'll be going to a new school. A bittersweet day of farewells marked by tears and hugs, both happy and sad. Everyone's always going to remember Crescent. It's not like it's going away forever. It's still going to be in their hearts, and it's just closing right now. Now, talking to some of the teachers and the staff today, some of them don't yet know where or if they will be in GRPS for the next year. Some are having to apply for new jobs within the district. Coming up, we'll introduce you to one of them who has spent half of her life here at Crescent. So much time here that she actually calls it her second home. Live in Grand Rapids tonight, Danny Carlson, 24 Hour News 8.